que é que temos para hoje? Hello, welcome to my toilet review of Asakusa Kid. This is a Japanese uh, movie, it's a drama on, uh, that is on Netflix, uh, like a biopic about uh, the early years of the uh, career of uh, Takashi Kitano, mostly known as Beat Takashi. Um, it's in, uh, when he became a comedian and he was doing um, how he started in a theater. Yeah, it's a mixture of theater with a strip club. Uh, the early days of his career, he had a, he, I think I read something he was mixed up with the Yakuza and in the movie he says he was like a, a week or two in the university, then he quit and then he started working uh, or wherever and he ended up in that uh, theater uh, slash strip club uh, and he, it's about how he was mentor, mentored by um, someone that uh, was known as a master of comedy in Tokyo, in Asakusa uh, wherever, <laughs> however you pronounce that uh, that neighborhood of Tokyo, Tokyo, and um, yeah, it's about how he became uh, known and uh, how he became kind of a, a legend in uh, Tokyo and a legend in Japan and uh, how he became known in the rest of the world, but it's mostly how he became known in Japan, in Japan's television. So, how he started in that theater, how he went on uh, on the road with a friend uh, doing a comic duo that to me looks like uh, Japanese stand-up stand comedy and how they went to television and became known and he better known than his uh, partner in that com comedic duo. I enjoyed this movie but I was expecting something better. The story is interesting. Uh, it's a it's quite dramatic, but it didn't bring up uh, enough uh, emotion in me to to be as good as I was expecting to be as enjoyable in a, like in a dramatic sort of way, um, and I, I think it's because I'm really not a big fan of uh, live action uh, Japanese movies that are not action driven. If it's action like, uh, you know, samurai stuff like that, I mostly enjoy if they are well made. This movie is well made, but um, like the Japanese uh, sensibilities in this kind of movies, it's n not really my thing. Uh, but I think it, it is a very interesting story just just not my thing um the writing the acting I, I think is also good it's not over the top as sometimes some asian stuff and some of the uh, other japanese stuff that i watched are more over the top and this is not uh i think the they did a, the actors did a good job but it's really not my kind of movie uh i think they should have um, Something is lacking in the movie. Besides not being my type of movie, something else is lacking in the movie. So it doesn't bring out uh, everything I, I was expecting this kind of movie to bring and the subject matter, the story that happens, the drama that uh, happens in his life and uh, his master's life, his master's wife, how he breaks up uh, with his master, how they reconcile. Uh, and so on and so forth uh, the hardships he had in the beginning of his, of his career in the theater and then the hardships he had on the road with everything I said everything to me would make a better movie than what I watched uh, I think so and the part where there is some comedy in the middle of the drama I think almost never laugh because I don't know if it's the barrier of the language and I'm just reading the subtitles. To me, that comedy is either old and uh, out, uh, outdated 
or it's not really my thing also. So with all, with all in mind and with all I said that uh, I enjoyed, I didn't enjoy, I have to give it three poop emojis because it kind of stinks to me. I imagine for other people it will be way better experience, some others maybe worse. Uh, anyway, if you're interested, interested in watching a biopic about the early days of Takashi Kitano, I do recommend this movie. If you are interested in watching some dramatic Japanese movie also, uh, if you don't uh, care, maybe skip it. But it's on Netflix if you are a subscriber, watch it if you have the free time. Uh, I would say if you uh, really don't like the movie in the first half hour, you will know and you can click out and watch something else. Anyway, three poop emojis and now I do need to flush. Ciao ciao! Limpar o cu agora. Um, dois, três, quatro folhas.